Okay guys, we are back. I know it and you know it. We need revenge. Last mission was a complete disaster. Not only did we fail the mission, but we lost two soldiers and the rest were injured. So yeah, we need revenge and we need it badly. And if we take a look at the armory now, we are in a really shitty situation. We have four rookies that's not injured rest of the team is out so uh, what we're going to do is we can't take any mission until a few of them gets back in business uh, we're gonna finish I uh, think we have uh, yeah one day left on uh, building the relay but we are going to force to decline missions because uh, everything else will be a complete disaster so yeah that one is done and also, we lost West uh, Asia. Uh, since we failed the mission here and it was a complete disaster, we lost the zone. We need to make contact with them again. So yeah, a really shitty situation here. Commander, we've utilized all of our available communications capacity. We can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our systems. That's not true. Yes, it's for with West Asia. Well, that's kind of a high volume. Let's we'll see if we can do anything about that after the cinematic. And now I'll. Advanced Warfare Center is done, which means our soldiers, when they get promoted, they can get bonus abilities, I believe, from other classes. But yeah, that spawn could be really overpowered if you get a bit lucky with it, I guess. But yeah, let's lower the audio a bit. It's pretty low. Is it what that was a sound effect? Not quite sure. Uh, but yeah, that one could be really strong. And we are definitely, uh, we're definitely going to go for this one. Because uh, that means our soldiers will heal quicker. And we need that one badly. Okay, oh, now we are at maximum contacts. Now let's build the tower so we get more supplies from it. No, we can't even do that. We can't afford it. We don't have uh, enough supplies uh, to build it. So let's just go to the headquarter to heal faster. And before we start healing, Let's take a look at the soldiers. We managed to get the ranger back here. Uh, and now you can see the time the, a lot quicker when we, since we are at the headquarter and we also got that bonus from uh, from the new facility. So yeah, we will go. We are going to be able to get a bunch of them back quickly, which is fantastic because we need them. Communication coming in for you now, Commander. It is unfortunate, Commander, that your recent efforts have proven to be so mediocre. Thank you for the kind words. But yeah, well, it was mediocre because we failed badly last mission, so yeah. So what can happen here? Fly drops, obviously that's bad news. And that's shady too. And let's reveal this one. Yeah. A 
lot of bad news. That's great. Let's go for the resources. We need them badly. This could be interesting. This could be interesting. Um, so now we can, can create some armor. Maybe that will keep our guys from making sure that they're not dying. These robotic units, developed by Advent, seem to be wholly autonomous, capable of targeting and engaging selected units without reliance on external verification. Although it falls on me to work through the initial disassembly, I fully intend on involving Shen in this process, as her knowledge of robotics far outweighs my own. So let's see. I saw medical breakthroughs that would have been considered nothing short of miraculous. Battle scans are good, flashbang are good. All well, this one is good too. So much things we want here. But most of it. Getting armor would be great. <clears throat> So we get more more protection and inventory slots. Want like all of it. I want all of it, uh, but we are low on supplies. Going to wait. Ah, uh, we do. To see if any of the troops have been keeping count on alien kills. Might be a useful recruiting tool. Yeah, I'm gonna wait with them until the next mission. I want to take a look our current uh, sharpshooter. This weapon is using right now is a normal sniper rifle. And that means actually we are ready for a new mission now, that's good. Um Hello, but Commander. What items we can create, weapons. I guess this one would be the, the upgrade for the sharpshooter. This one we definitely want to build. And we want to get those for the whole team. And the pruning grounds, is there anything new going on here? Let's see. Oh, these are some cool stuff too. There's so many things here I would like to have. What's the difference between... This is a heavy version of uh, plated armor. And I guess this is a lighter one then. Oh, grappling hook, that sounds perfect for sharpshooters too. Let's go for this one. Now we want those supplies. Have a new staff available. Uh, get into this. So, scientist, sharpshooter, but I don't feel like we can afford them right now. Great. And what I want.
want to build this obviously a resistance calm so we can uh, make more contacts let's see what we got uh, Up with. Oh, rookies becomes a specific classes. That's also a really good one. Type of a staff. Assign a rookie to train. Oh, assign a rookie to train a specific class. Uh, let's check out the classes we have right now. Use soldiers. So, we have two sharpshooters. We have three specialists. We have three rangers. We need like uh, some heavy guys, I think. Mm. So, Claudia. Let's try this one out. We'll see. Let's take another, another year then. Try that. Need to try it. Yeah. There's some interesting stuff here too. Uh, definitely some interesting uh, stuff we want to um, go for. So much things we want. I want it all. That old Warren G song. But yeah, we, we, uh, we need to build first. And what we definitely need to build. Commander, I appreciate you recruiting new staff for the engineering team, but as it stands, we have people still waiting for an assignment. We need Commander, resistance comms. Excavation or staffing a facility. Commander, construction of this shadow chamber should allow us to better break down and analyze all the alien artifacts and data we've been recovering. So in eight days, we can make contact with a new place. So is there anything else we can do? I mean, what happens if we try to make contact without a release? Now we can't even do that. So let's check out the black market, see what they have for us. Market is open. Market is open. No refunds. What can we buy? Crystals, scopes, actually buy supplies for intel. Specialist, oh we can rush researches, but don't think we need that. I don't think there's anything we want to buy right now. Or actually we could check out selling too, but I don't think we will sell anything yet either, because I don't know what we're going to, to need in the future. When you play this game a bit more, then like for the second third or third round when you're really like really into it uh, and probably you know what you need and what you don't need spider suit and that means we can uh, create another one was it the proving grounds i'm not sure We did this project, but that's mean that like thought that we we like get to know it. But maybe we have one now. Let's see. It's gonna take a random soldier. Yeah, okay, it's available that way. Let's check out one of our sharpshooters. Um. So this one he's using right now, it's uh, the Kevlar armor and um, we can see what it does here. So what it will do is it will increase uh, health, uh, mobility and dodge, that's fantastic. Then I will definitely like to create another one and then we will go for the heavy ones but because I think those will be fat perfect for snipers. <clears throat> so let's create another one. Sounds good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is complete.
I've made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. Advent has legions of these mechanized units out there helping to keep the... There's so many projects. As far as I can tell, they're fully automated and armed to the teeth. This is a weapon, I'm interested. Nah. Central Officer Bradford has personally substantiated claims that the massive frontline unit they call the Muton was actually at one time even larger than the specimen I have before me today. <coughs> As it is, the creature is abnormally warm to the touch for a corpse, and I must say, it is quite disconcerting. Cute guy. <laughs> Still nothing at all we can do. So, now we have a chance to counter one of the dark events, and now's the question, which one do we want to try to counter? That decreases supply drops, and it's a difficult mission. This one, uh, reinforcements. Moderate mission. And this one... Oh, the block. I hate the block. With bones to supplies. Engineer. Or a scientist. And I feel like we really need an engineer. We are using every single one of our engineers right now. So let's go for this one. For and also we need uh, to get back in business in West uh, Asia, because that's where we failed the last mission. So we need to get some success here. And uh, just to try to see what we have. I'm going to remove the Captain Thomas here. Probably going to add him again. He's going to see what we can choose for him. Hmm. I like to fall to two sharpshooters. But then we need to uh to remove one of the rangers so we can have at least one grenadier. I now want to make things available. And we want to give one of the sharpshooters um, that nice special um, armor. And um, also, let's see, this might have been a mistake by mine, but in XCOM 1, you could uh, create uh, weapons uh, like Just give the word and instantly. Uh, I don't know if you can do it here. I just need to try it out. Yeah, it's an instant build. So let's build one fantastic sniper rifle too, and now check it out to see. Uh, To see um, how good or bad it is. It's 
So this weapon. This weapon does 4 to 6 damage. Green clip size and a 10% crit chance. And now is the question, what about this one? Four to six. Four to six compared to six to eight. So yeah, we are increasing. Uh, we are increasing the damage. And also, it has uh, it has a bonus um, aim here. So. Uh, What about weapon upgrades? Yeah, this one has two slots. This one is really good. But I think this one might be even better. And uh, yeah, you get one yeah, too. So much to uh, go through here. Yeah, I think we are ready. But what I noticed is uh, this took a lot of time. Uh, I had so much to go through. Uh, and so much to shake up and we had to wait a lot of time. So I'm actually going to split this mission in two episodes Because otherwise we will have a mission if the if the next mission is a long one It could be like a one and a half hour movie because uh, we're already up to like 25 minutes So we're gonna end this episode here and then we will start the next one with the mission So thank you so much for watching really appreciate it Please press that subscribe button. It helps out a lot and uh, the next episode will out pretty like directly off this one and that will be the mission because yeah as i said if we combine them it will be like an one and a half hour movie or something like that and that's a bit too long so yeah thank you so much for watching and next episode will be out in a few